Okay, so Kate's gonna hit the ball into the middle and she's gonna replace. Allie's gonna hit that ball wherever and she's gonna replace. So we wanna see the sticks down, we wanna see good pop on the passes, and we wanna have some communication. So let's just watch a quick demo over here, you guys. Here we go. Go ahead. Stick down, stick down, Becky, stick down. Okay, so it's five star hit and replace. Really working on getting our sticks down, right, Becky? Yep, okay. All right, we good over there? Okay, five star hit and replace. Let's do it. Stick down, stick down, McCall. That's good pop on that. It's a really good a drill just for uh, a little bit of ball, off ball movement and communication. Good, good. Keeping that pass on the ground, Ferdy. <coughs> Good, nice ball, nice ball. Soften up those hands Okay, out. so some keys with this is you always wanna have good communication. That You need to make it clear with who you're passing to. Uh, good vision, eyes up, stick to stick passing. Uh, really be in dynamic. You don't wanna hold on to the ball too long. You'll see that the groups go very, very quickly. We always have some extra balls around the outside of the star too, so that if a uh, ball's missed, they could just grab a ball right away and jump back into it. You should constantly hear chatter. Um, throughout your group as they're going, there should be an intense amount of communication, just constant. Heads One of the things at ESU we really pride, our, pride ourselves in is that all of our drills that we do at speed, we love to get most of our conditioning um, in the drills rather than just say, hey, go out for a two mile run. It's much more game-like and better for your physiology to get your conditioning in uh, in the drills. Good pass. Okay, ladies, let's hold up there. Okay, you guys, let's demo. Um, five star hit and um, make a switch. Okay, so Jesse passed uh, to whoever, make that pass. And she makes that pass and she's just gonna run a switch with that. So that really works on off ball movement. And it really works on the person that's receiving the pass with good vision so she's not passing to someone who's switching. Good? Okay, so that's five star hit and, and uh, switch. Okay, same thing over there, ladies. Five star hit and switch. Make a switch. Sticks down, so you're ready to go. This just kind of amps it up a little bit with the communication because now when you get rid of that ball, you need to find somebody and switch the positioning. And actually, in a game, the more you could do this without being totally chaotic with it, the better it is because it really throws off your, your opponent when you can... Uh, make those switches, especially for the forward line, switching and, and creating that movement, then it throws off the other, your, other, your opponent uh, with their marks. Um, another thing that we do, we usually, um, while we're doing our ball control and passing drills and things that aren't to goal, we always have our keepers working at the other end, um, doing different warm-up drills and drills that we would give to them beforehand to go over. A lot of times we have some players that maybe are a little bit injured, but they can still hit and do some things. They'll go down and work, and we'll have our GAs working with the keepers a lot too. All right, 10 seconds. Good job, good job with your communication, ladies. Good, good feet, Jesse. good feet. Good.